Greetings, up chappers. Oof. 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 <laughs> Oof. It's the filaments. And I learned a word recently. Which what word is, did you learn? I learned the word, well, not recently, a while back. It's called filipenduous. Filipenduous. Filipenduous means suspended by a single thread. So, for example, if, like someone a spider. Had, if somebody had an argument and they said, oh, this filament's pedal is no good because it hasn't, it's got too much gain, you go, your argument is filipenduous. It is, it is single pointed. Wow. That's no good. I'll be honest with you. I thought this was a signature pedal of the uh, Christian satanic dark death metal uh, lead guitar player, <laughs> Phil Laments. <laughs> but uh, maybe I'm wrong. He maybe laments. I'm wrong. Um, <laughs> Filaments, what you get in light bulbs, aren't they? And tubes. Yeah. I've just worked it out, of course. Right. It's the filament of It's the tiny weak part that breaks. There's even a graphic, if I'd have paid more attention, on the pedal of a valve. Looks like a 6L6 or a KT88 or something like that. And uh, <laughs> yes, this is uh, from Robert Keeley, who, I've got to be honest with you, I've started following on Facebook and Instagram recently, and he is a funny guy. Yes, He does Did not you take know? himself seriously. Did you he know? He's a really funny guy. Captain Lee now has an Instagram account, Woo! and it's called Captain Anderton. Underscore. Captain underscore, underscore. Anderton. So it's like Captain Anderton. Because we like the underscore. I have one, I'm Rob <laughs> underscore Chappers. <laughs> All about the underscore. Un underscore. Feed the pony. As if you would um, feed a pony. So you should follow him on Instagram. And also maybe follow me if you'd like and to. And Facebook and Twitter like. and all the other crap forms of social media if you want that I'm trying to keep up with as I reach an age <laughs> in my life where I might go back to using a feather quill um, <coughs> and a pot of ink. <laughs> Hello! And a dove. And <laughs> yeah, a pigeon to send things from <laughs> point to point. Anyway, so the filaments, yeah, is a, is a very compact, high gain, multi-stage, tube stacked with no tubes, piece of black and red win wow. with a switch on it like this. Wow. Um, and yeah, it's just so, Rob's got uh, a, a, an, an M, what have you got? Is got it your signature? RC, bro. It's Which the is, last one in Anderton's, I think. So this is, this is the final one of the outgoing Chapman range. From the Legacy oh. range. The <laughs> Legacy range, well named that man. Um, named by Joe Leach, if you we should say that. So, even though it's a small pedal, uh, we have got six knobs and three switches, and I will tell you about them. So listen up, people. Level, presence, gain, bass, body, treble, boost switch, bright switch, crunt switch. Missed the, cocked it up on the last word. Didn't crunch quite, switch crunch is quite hard to say though, to properly, be honest. Crunch switch. Crunch switch. And they crunch all switch. do things. So let's uh, let's plug into a... Crunch switch. We're staying with our, with our dual amp rig here. So we've got an amp that sounds a bit like this. And an amp that sounds a bit like this. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Should we back that gain down? That's quite pokey. That, is it pokey? It? Well, pokey, let me, let me pokey McPokey. Let me depoke it. What about the underscore? Go on, Rob, do it. If I counter lead, <clears> I hear your leg. I touched his knee. He's wearing shorts. What's going on? Sounds exactly the same. It doesn't sound the same. It sounds very different. <laughs> it's... It's so, just these hugely powerful Seymour Duncan pickups. They so are hugely powerful Seymour Duncan pickups. Yes. So uh, we'll stay with the clean amplifier and we'll use the filaments to see how dirty we can get. Then we'll do the same. We'll see what effect we can get when we add it to a distorted amplifier. And then we'll do the two do for the two. fun. Um, Say crunch switch. Crunch switch. Crunch switch. It is difficult. Crunch, crunch switch. switch. No, if you say it fast, you can't do it. Crunch switch. Say what guam Switch ting. becomes wrong. We say what guam a ting. 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 President Wensleydale. I can't do accents. You know, I can. I can literally do. I can. I can talk more posh, and I can do a northern accent. But that's all I can do. Lee thinks he can do a northern accent. Yeah, I say I can do a northern <laughs> accent. I can't do a northern accent either. Uh, let's see if I can do the. Wait, wait, that. stop raining. Air bagum. Here we go with filament spell. <laughs> Press button here for maximum gain.
I messed that run up, Lee. It's fine, and I intentionally, but I wanted to turn it off halfway through the run, but as you castigated me in the last demo for doing well, that, I, messed that I didn't I put, do it again. I've hurt my finger. It's a good job it wasn't the other one, wasn't it? I've injured it? it. I got some scar tissue on the end from a, a silly accident as a child, and I bruised it, and so I went and put nines on this guitar, but I used 10 to 52, so it's a different feel. Let me try the run again. Put it on again. <laughs> Well done, sir. Right, let's take you through what the, the knobs and buttons are doing, particularly the crunch switches. Um, I believe that the downwards position of the switch is the off mode and the upwards position is the, is the on mode. And I've been told that these are specially customized. So the switches are about this much lower down than a normal switch would be to avoid you touching them with your hairy toes when you turn this on and off. So, so there we are. <laughs> We all um, now know that Lee has hairy toes. Somewhere in the world will now be a foot fetish website. Toes? A foot fetish website. Uh, on the, on the, like, the knuckle feet. bit of your toe, haven't you got little tufts of hair? I uh, really have hairy yeah. feet. Okay, overshare. I thought all men did. When I was born, mm? I had hairy feet like a hobbit. Literally proper hairy feet? Yes. Did you come out feet first as well and fling no. the switch shit out of everybody? No, I, going, came out, I, came out, I came out like this. Mm, <laughs> welcome. <laughs> Did you watch Theo coming out? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> what did you do that for? Yeah, they went, you can look now, you can look now. Cool. cool. Oh. <laughs> but I couldn't see much through the teary eyes. <laughs> oh, dear. It's a mess being a dad. <laughs> right. Come on. Let's, right. So let, I'm, I'm trying, gonna, man. Yeah, you're right. So it's, you're talking it's, about... It's my fault. I'm going to start feet. with everything at 12 o'clock. The switch is off and the gain all the way down. Right, and I'm going to tap that out will... and I'm going to back off and get a little bit of breathiness. Mm. And that warms it up. That's if you not, that's not what this jazz. pedal is designed for. That's not what for. it's for, is it? No. Okay, what about... You know, to sort of chug on a nine. You know what I like about pedals where I like it when the good sound is with all the knobs at twelve o'clock. Yes. And you and you sit there going, I wonder if, what the point of the knobs are. I think it's it's like psychological. It's like the designer goes, I bet I've made this pedal that just sounds amazing, but I better put some knobs on it just because that's what people want. Even though everything will just be at twelve o'clock all the time, apart right. from the gain control. I see. Anyway, let's see what these switches do. So keep playing. Right. Boost. Boost it. It's thicker. It's thicker. It's like you've added a boost, an extra layer of bread to your sandwich. What that, was that? That was the brightness switch. Guess what that does? It brightens the load. It's honest. Literally, the voice of the Lord just came through a speaker in the room and went, I went, it's too quiet. It's too quiet. It's too quiet. Make so, it less quiet. So we've turned. Why it was too quiet. 
to the crunt switch. Clearly adds a load of level into the mix. So careful when you're using this. It might catch you Boom! Underwear. That's what it yeah. did. It was just like balls in. That's the crunch. Crunch is the wrong it, word. What it, it made enough room that it put the balls that, in. That should literally be like like with about seven U's and a few A's in there. Could you? What was that noise you just made? Well, that's what that's what it, that's what the switch should be called. Switch. You, you are literally, you are literally like Lamb of God Metal Screamer, but you don't know it. It's absolutely <laughs> so great. So let's uh, let's try the <laughs> crunch Ready? thing. That is like uh, an eight dB boost. Minute eight and a half, I reckon. Eight three quarters, <laughs> probably. Eight three quarters. <laughs> That sounds great now. And without, I is know. It, is it the volume that makes it go? Anyway, let's see what. Let's see if it hold that. Give it three, one. Is it still there? Um, let's see what it sounds like into a mildly crunchy amp. One suspects we may not need all these settings. Well, you so, know what? These early ball strings are very good. They are. They, what are you they using? Retain their, cobalt. They retain their tunage and everything. You saw nines? Yeah, I put nines on because mm. I, I've got a, a sore finger. Hey, is that what you've put on? Uh, yeah. Oh, you've gone cobalt on our asses. What? Woman, Hansi Hao, Chung Engineered to maximize output and clarity. That's good because we need cobalt clarity. Which does sound Catch. like a. Oh, it's like a washing powder. Right, here's the amp. See what it sounds like through both amps. <laughs> one. Um, <laughs> so it's good. It's good. It sounds really fat. I like it. Um, so there we are. What do you go? Filaments and get out. He's got a solo album coming out soon. Um, <laughs> you know, Keely. Full of sad songs. Filaments sing sad songs. Right. Keely, know a thing or two.
They do. They, they do. do. They make good pedals. They've been doing it a long Obviously. time, so they blooming well should do. They blooming well they should blooming do. They blooming well should do. We love them. I'm Rob Chapman. And he's a funny guy. Yeah, I, he's Rob Chapman. I'm the captain. See you later. Bye! Tell me about Rory. So he uh, edits videos. Rory's awesome. Yeah.